Hi, my name is Barry. I'm almost 57 years old and has cystic fibrosis. I use a MicroLife handheld spirometer model PF100 here at home to check my PFTs to make sure my lung function is holding steady between clinic visits. I do this once a week. To use this spirometer, you simply press the blue I.O. button and wait until you hear two beeps. Now the spirometer is ready to use. You will have approximately one minute to take a deep breath and blow into the colored mouthpiece before the spirometer automatically turns off. When you are ready, you will wrap your lips around the colored mouthpiece, then take a deep breath in and exhale quickly, just as you would in clinic or your doctor's office. Continue exhaling until you hear the spirometer beep. Your readings will be displayed on the screen. First, you will see a PEF or peak excretory flow measured in liters per minute, followed by your FEV1 measured in liters. You will have approximately one minute to perform another test before the spirometer turns off. I usually do three tests and record the highest FEV1 number just as we do in clinic. The readings you see on this spirometer will most likely not match what you see in clinic. However, this doesn't matter. We're looking for a relative change in FEV1 from one week to the next. Discuss with your doctor when to contact them based on concerns uh, you see if you have a change in your spirometer readings or other symptoms you may have. Let's do my PFTs together. First, we'll turn on the spirometer and wait for two beeps. I'm going to pause the video for 45 seconds between tests so you don't have to watch me rest. Let's check my first reading. My first reading is 2.88. See you in 45 seconds. Now let's do my second reading. This FEV1 number was 2.86. Now for another small break. Now for my third test. Nice. That was 2.94. Now a 2.94 for me will convert over to 65% based on my age, height, and me being a male. See your doctor or clinic and see if they can help you develop a chart to show you that how your spirometer readings can be converted into percentage for you. Thank you for watching and I hope this was informative. Enjoy your day, stay healthy, and challenge yourself to get stronger.